All right, so this is the uh, rainwater garden watering system that I'm building. And uh, so this is my rainwater uh, capturing tank. And then it basically feeds over by gravity to the other tank. And when this tank is full, pretty much about half the tank drains and it'll equal about half a tank over here. So about half and half, I need to raise this up a little bit more, get a little bit more flow into it. But I figure if this is, if I try to keep this one full, uh, we'll be good to go. And I can always add water from the house, you know, if I need to. And I'm mainly doing this for one reason is because uh, we have chlorinated water and it's terrible for the garden. And the other reason is I have barrels laying around. I have these rain barrels set up and to use gravity fed, like ho a hose, it takes forever to, to water everything. So cool thing is I bought a uh, flow jet pump, water pump. Cool thing about these, uh, these are like RV pumps. So when the end of the hose is closed and it builds up back pressure, uh, the flow will, will turn off, the actual pump will turn off. I turn this on and shoot water out, you can hear the pump and it cuts off. So flow jet pump, awesome, basically right now I got it like, feeding off the uh, battery that is the solar heater. And uh, it is, let's see if we can get what we got here, 5.2 amps. It's not that bad. It's got a pretty good flow to it too, uh, as far as like the push. It's uh, got a pretty good push to it, so it's not, it's not bad at all. It can move some gallons, so this is what's going to basically feed back over to there. It's going to come up and water all of these beds and keep the beds watered because what better way to do it than with rainwater? And I may actually add some uh, in the barrel here. I can always take the bung plug out the top and I'm thinking about pouring, um, also adding um, some compost tea to it to kind of mix it up. And uh, I should do it because it's going to be kind of used continually. And as I add water to it from the, if I have to add it from the garden hose at least, the uh, chlorine will evaporate out of it and as the water sits it'll be good. So rainwater is the way to go, but that's what I'm building right now. When I get everything fixed, finished, I'll show it to you because I got to get something to uh, to keep the, the pump away from the elements and stuff. But it's cool. I dig it. You guys take it easy. Peace out.